Gerbert of Orillac was an important scientist and clergyman who lived in the 10th century. He was born in 946 in the town of Orillac, France. At a young age, he began his education at the saint Gerode Monastery. Thanks to his exceptional intelligence, he was soon recognized. He gained deep knowledge in fields such as mathematics, astronomy, and music. During his student years, he traveled to Spain and studied under Muslim scholars in Andalusia. He became one of the first major figures to bring Arabic science to Europe. He introduced the use of the abacus and the Arabic numeral system to Europe. At the time, because his knowledge was seen as extraordinary, some people thought he was a sorcerer. It is also reported that he designed mechanical clocks and primitive automatons. In 972, he came under the protection of Archbishop Adalbero of Reims. There, he worked as a teacher and became recognized as an influential scholar. While pursuing science, he also strengthened his political connections. Through these, he caught the attention of Emperor Otto II. He later served as abbot at the Abbey of Fulda. After the death of Pope Gregory V in 999, Gerbert was elected pope and took the name Sylvester II. This event marked an important turning point in European history. During his papacy, Sylvester II supported science and education. He established a close collaboration with Holy Roman Emperor Otto III. He embraced the aim of revitalizing Europe culturally and scientifically. Throughout his time as Pope, Sylvester II continued to value scientific studies. He died in 1003. He left behind the legacy of a visionary leader who sought to unite religion and science. Today, he is recognized as a significant figure in both religious and scientific history.